Greetings folks, Pockets here back with some Reeve Online, once again on Cursed, our Mimitar Alpha, trying to get to battleships eventually. In our last episode we ran our first couple of missions and got ourselves started, got ourselves set up with our destroyer and the one before that. But since then the agency event, arms race, has started and I've run a couple of them in my another video on my channel, I've run a couple of the sites on Pockets. And they're pretty fun but as they're alpha centric sites i was thinking i wanted to grind them up on cursed as well uh, some of the benefits are definitely worth getting into especially for an alpha so i've run a few sites in this destroyer they can get a little hairy especially when you get the battle cruiser spawns but they can be done so I'll, i've run a few sites you can see here i'm already at 100 points i've already cashed in my battle cruiser box uh, we got a luckily we got a hurricane I assume that's going to be the one it was, and that's what we got. So it means when we get there, we won't have to buy one of these ships. So that saves us probably around 50 million. I haven't checked the market, but battle cruisers are in and around there. 30, 50, somewhere in there. I'd like to for sure get to here, which I should be able to do even in this video maybe. And if we get to the battleship, I'm actually toying with the idea of selling it in like Dodixie or Jita. Just to get that extra funds and maybe get training implants to speed that stuff up a little bit. But let's get out here and I will run a site. In our alpha destroyer i will bring up the fitting for those that don't remember i have some ideas for tweaks i haven't played around with it yet uh the, like i said for this site it gets a little hairy but we got the 200 millimeter light prototype auto cannons in the highs all the various ammos we need right now i'm fighting with fusion but i might switch them out and try something different against these rats two adaptive invulnerability fields we did this because we weren't sure what type of rats were going to be in the missions and it works well against drones as well because they seem to do all the different types of damage mono propellant enduring afterburner one mega newton type d restrained capacitor power relay gives us cap stability counterbalance compact gyro stabilizer give it a little extra dps a lot of these are holding place like we'll get the t2 of these and these eventually and then an anti-EM and anti-thermal screen just to bring our resistance in those weaker areas up. So two EMs. So we've got two EMs and a thermal to bring our resistances up. Doesn't, doesn't make me happy. I don't think we'd be able to run level two missions with this fit just based on, and I'll show you in these rogue swarm sites, how bad it really holds against sustained fire. I mean, it doesn't matter in level one, so I'm hoping to be able to afford a nice decent cruiser by the time we get into level 2s. There's a site here, we'll see if anybody's running it. This ship does not race very well. I've had, I haven't had any luck racing anybody. Uh, there's lots of site running type, but again this is a mission hub as well, so a lot of these guys could be running missions. And various stages, but we'll see what's on site. Either way I'm going to stick around and kill what I can. Uh, even the little drones give you the kill credits, so it's good just to kill them even. So like we have a Gnosis already here. I'm just going to go through and wipe out all these Apuses and let him do the site because it's his. Because this will give us credit towards the kill. I'm not going to steal his Overlord or his Overmine. So he's wiping out these little things too, it looks like. He has figured it out. Alright, well. If he's not going to shoot the cruiser, I am. Is he sending one drone over to the cruiser? Yeah, he's taking out the cruiser. That's fine. We'll find our own site. I don't like stealing sites. He looks like a new player. I've, I ran into him a couple times already. So we're just going to go to the next zone. Let him have this site. All right, we have a site here just next door. I'm gonna pop in here, we'll see. Once we get closer, what shows up? Drake. I miss flying my Drake in level three missions. I think it was a monster back in the day. Scan, I said. Looks like the site got abandoned, so we're going to go ahead and finish it. There's a lot of these little shippies here. But, I think we can switch. We can take these guys out. 
I think. Uh, the nice thing is, like I said, or the nice thing is, these drones count to our kill score, so they help us get quicker to our goal of finishing the event. Oh, let's turn these on. So I've just chose one of the frigates at random to orbit, and I'm going to try to wipe these guys out before we uh, take too much damage. They seem to one-shot, which is nice. There's another... We got our injector, so <laughs> that's pretty sweet. That's pretty sweet. We'll be able to... I'll probably try and... I'll probably save it till we're done our 5 million free. But it is 50... 50... 50,000? Yeah, 50,000 free experience... Or experience. Wow, I can't even talk today. 50,000 free skill points. So, not a bad little boost. We are not holding well. We are not holding well at all. We gotta get some of these killed or else we're gonna have to get out of here. Oh yeah, this isn't working. What's doing the most damage? It's just these Apis. There's just so many of them and they do about what we do as passive recharge, so... We'll see. See what we can do. into armor now so have to watch it if we start if we get to half armor I gotta bug out but we did get our uh, can't words injector so take that come on nope we're out of here I didn't quite make it I tried to get to the afterburner before it recycled but it was just too quick go 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 get out of here into structure almost Okay, so yeah, it is doable. It is hard. Whoever triggered that spawned a lot of these Apis drones. We did get credit for some of them, which is nice. So we are up over the 120. Let's see what we got. We have five more days to finish this. We're exactly at 120. And we're getting 13 points for killing 40 drones. I did notice on pockets when you get to the end, I don't know if it's four or five. It just starts over again at number one and builds up. So... We're just going to keep running these things. Let me quickly repair my ship. And we'll get back out. We may have to go to a different site. Or a different system. But we will definitely get this done. Alright, here we go. We have a swarm here. Let's get in there. As we get close, we'll try descan. Space isn't scanning for me anymore. Darn it, I'll have to fix that too. Okay. I don't think I mapped space to this guy. So many little things. Every time you start a character. I'm too lazy to set up a config file and keep it saved and move it. I should probably do that one day now that I have so many characters. But, you know. An empty rogue swarm. This is great. This is good. We will work with this guy. See, he's the most threatening, so maybe we'll kill him first this time. I have been killing the frigates and stuff, but the cruisers still seem to hit us and do the most damage, so whoop, turn our tank on. Afterburner. Close the distance. We'll see. There's only one guy here. We can see what he's up to. Again, always throwing a high in local. If I'm going to be there for a few minutes. It's how you make friends. And friends are important. We just had someone join us, so we'll probably see a visitor here momentarily. We'll shoot a little bit outside. Especially against the cruiser. Oh, we missed. There we go. So much little damage. You can see the difference as we close in. 31 versus 137 once we get close. And our default orbit's 900. That's perfect. And if we can kill this guy, we'll take less damage. As you can see him, Destructor. So these guys are doing like 7 and 9, which is not a problem. He's missing us, so that's good. They do up to like 40 damage, which is 10 times our passive regen. <laughs> so... I'm hoping not too many of those little drone dronelets spawn in this one because that would suck. The destroyer has the potential to do more damage, so we'll get rid of him next. And we'll try to keep our shields as preserved as possible for the coming swarm. I am enjoying running these sites a lot. I mean, they're just PV sites. It's not that special, but it's fun. Because you do get those big swarms, and I have to watch and make sure I keep moving and... So he's almost dead. We'll start orbiting this guy. Well, you know what? It probably would be a lot quicker if I was using both guns. I, I re-split them for the swarms because I was wasting a lot of ammo trying to take out those swarms. I'm pretty sure they would go down in half as much DPS. Like this stack is... What? 175, 196... Like 230 DPS. 
Same thing with the cruiser. This time with both guns. <laughs> There's the downside to splitting the guns, I guess. Are we orbiting? We are. T shield is holding. Holding well this time. So we may not have to hit the panic button again. Take this guy out. Grumpy Kitty just jumped it in. I know in high sec I don't actually have to watch local quite so much, but it's such a habit from living in uh, low sec for so long. Just, just watch it. Low sex, someone you don't know pops in, you gotta start watching because there's a good chance they're coming to kill you. Alright, so we will try and get this guy down. Perfect. This should be the wave with the, the boss man. Nope. So we'll start orbiting. We'll target him. Set target. Get both guns firing. See if we get any more of these a a apis. If we do and we decide we don't want to stick around, we can just leave. We can usually I can usually get through the cruiser before they've done too much damage. But it's going well this time. I'm calm, I'm collected. And things are going well, so we're just gonna gonna roll with it. Gonna roll with it. Keeping an eye on everything. Still surprised we haven't seen damn it, space press still doesn't work. Spitter guns, because they do enough damage. Ah, we probably shouldn't have, but whatevs. Finish this guy off, orbit him. Then we'll orbit this thing to keep our traversal up. We'll try to pick him off. See what, one shot? Yep, that's beautiful. Uh, there he is. We'll get him first, get him out of the way. Starting to take a bit of damage. Are they out of range? They are, so we'll kill a couple of these as we close the distance. I want to target you. start shooting. We gotta take these cruisers out quick. So they're doing all this damage. Shouldn't be so bad. I shouldn't have dove straight in on them, but I'm reckless and I have a feeling once we got the cruisers down we'll be okay for a bit. And once he's close. Got both guns on him. He should be missing us now. Yeah. It's okay. I know my shields are almost down and it's a terrible disaster, but I think we'll be okay, my friend. I think we'll be okay. We'll orbit this guy, shoot him. Let's actually orbit him at current. Should have done that instead. So we don't dive in on him. Said shoot. Get him, get him, get him. And then we'll start picking these things off. Because we can kill them quick. Oh, we're into armor. Keep an eye on it. Did we get loot? We did. I'll bookmark it in case we have to save location. In case we have to leave and come back. It's okay, it's okay. We got these guys. Let's orbit this thing. Yeah, I know, we're in a structure. I'm doing it anyway. It's fun. We got this, we got this. What's this? Shoot him. Shoot him. Try to get this. Half structure. We got this. We got this. I'm not afraid. I don't want to lose this ship. We can't really afford to replace it. Are you... Dead yet? Oh boy. <laughs> okay, so we lost our ship because we got greedy. Son of a... Yeah, that happens. So let's go home. We'll get ourselves a new ship. <laughs> uh, shouldn't have done that. What do we got for ISK? Ah, we have enough to replace our ship. Mostly. Oh, there it is. Made a beautiful kill mail. Well, I got greedy. I thought I could race them out. And I failed. So... Oh. Okay, I will come up with a new fit. Maybe we'll just go with a cruiser or a frigate. I don't know. We'll see. Let me figure out what I'm going to do. 
I'll bring you guys back well I'm when I'm doing it. All right, and we're back, and we're set up with a new Thrasher. I had to do some travel around to get it. We're currently in the system, about four jumps to five jumps away from Dodixie. I had to go here to get ammo, because I could only find fusion at a reasonable price here. Uh, we're pretty much broke, but we got what we need to do. I think I'm actually going to fly around this system and look for another site. We're going to try this new fit. Get undocked, we'll bring up the fit, and I'll show you what I did. This time we have a passive or um, active shield tank. So the same guns. Wait for it to load now, of course. Tick tock. There we go. So we put on the same guns on all eight slots. So 200 millimeter light prototype auto cannons. Uh, when I was working with the fits, I noticed we now had the skills to do a T2 shield booster, so I threw that on there. So we have a small shield booster too. Gives us 17 hit points per second, so once the cruisers are down, we should be able to rep faster than we take damage. Uh, EM war, just to balance it out right now, because we're against rogue drones. I do plan on having one of each hardener, passive hardener, at some point. We can fit to the rats that we're fighting. One magnet mono monopropellant enduring afterburner. We have a counterbalance compact stabilizer. This is the same one we had before. Fourier compact tracking enhancer. And then in the rigs, we have a small semiconductor memory cell. We have two of them to get ourselves just three minutes worth of cap. That's with everything's running. We can turn things off and gain more if we need it. And a small projectile burst aerator, bringing us up to 156, which I believe is slightly lower than we were. But we should have more tank overall. And we'll just go into here. And you can see, without the shield boost wrong, we're perfectly stable. And we should only need to pulse this. With any luck. And if we turn off the afterburner, we can buy ourselves another minute and a half of repping. So we'll figure it out. It should be okay. But we're going to give it a test on the first site that we find. So I am going to bring up the map. We're going to find a dead end system. And we're going to fly to it. We're going to stay in this area because we have a little more option. So we can go here. That's a nice little dead end. It's the only one in this sort of constellation. But that'll be okay. Let's go there and see what we can see. And we'll bring you back when we find a site. Oh, before I leave, I did also manage to pick up some of our uh, fittings. I went back in my free starter ship that they give you when you pod a, dock in a pod in a station that doesn't already have a ship. Uh, four of the cannons for the 200 millimeter light cannons, the afterburner, and about a thousand rounds of ammo is what we looted back from the wreck. So we didn't have to buy those, which is lucky because as you can see, very, very low on money at this point. So, and also I named this ship because it's, don't be greedy because greed is what lost us our first ship. I thought I could uh, race them down, and I mean, I got pretty close, but at the end, they out DPSed me. I think I missed a couple target switches. I didn't switch the guns over quick enough. I probably could have squeezed it out if I had been just a little more on the ball with all of that, but that's just the way the cookie crumbles some days, right? We have a site here, so we're just going to go warp right into it. We'll probably have friends. I did. still haven't mapped space bar. We have a Gnosis and a Gila. We're going to just do what we can. We'll get some kills. It is a new day, so I don't know. It's not showing me there. We'll see it in a second. I don't want to... Yeah, so we're going to help this guy clear up some of these. I'm going to test my tank. That points for completing the site there, looks like. I'm going to just lock up some of these guys. Let's actually split into two sets of guns again. Good. And we'll just blap some of these and we'll get credit for the kills. Hooray! 
So you can see we take damage a little faster, but we can just pulse the Repper. Hmm, it's gonna be tight. There we go, yeah, we're getting points all over the place here. We just wanna get to that last stage and then we can get back to our missions. I'm not doing this for skins on this character. Yeah, see, we're just wiping them out. Beautifully. Helps that our friend, oh, we have to orbit this guy. Turn on our repper for a minute before we get to half. Yeah, this is working all right. I'd like to see what we can do solo, but we may not have to. Might be able to just grind up enough points here, helping people run sites. Grab some more of these. Let's get to that last battleship. I'd like to do it before we go all the way back to our mission hub because then we can just stop into Dixie and sell it. Maybe buy our training implants, the profits, just so I don't have to fly all the way back here once we have it. Okay. There we have it. Site cleared. Let's see how close we are. Did they leave any loot? No. Sometimes they leave the loot. Depending on what's in it, you know, take it. But if you do open a yellow wreck and take the loot out, you can get killed. So it's best not to if you're not ready for fighting or don't intend to defend yourself at all agency four days left so yeah so it is the next day i had to take it took too long so i had to take time off but we are back we are 50 points just under 30 points out so yeah let's go do another site doesn't even matter if we finish it we just want the credit uh for skins and stuff i'll be doing that all on pockets just because he's better set up for racing the sites and actually taking them but I want that battleship because that's, you know, could be up to 200 mil. I imagine we'll be getting a Tempest. So we look at this Tempest. So we can quickly, we can sell it for 90. That's not great. What about a male? Oops, I forgot the T. Mailstorm. So hopefully get a maelstrom and get 125 mil. After the things that leave us with you know 75 million to play with, which would be nice. And it'll be several months before we need to buy a battleship, so I'm not too worried about it in that context. But it'll give us the ability to fit a cruiser if we just or fit out our hurricane, depending on which we jump to. The other thing I want to do is see how much. Oh, should have checked that too. See if the alpha skill injectors. are on the market. I don't know if you can sell them. Daily Alpha Skill Injector. So buyers for 40 mil, they're about 60 mil because they're 20 plex and currently plex are going for like three something. So these are all very underpriced. I don't know why people would be selling them for under 50. Possibly getting the free ones. Omega is getting the free ones from the event. So we can make a little deal here if we sell the battleship we could buy one of these that wouldn't be a bad idea and just sit on it none here anyways i will decide what we're doing yeah plex that's what i was looking at plex 3.3 mil at so it's 66 million right now so buying them for 40 wouldn't be a bad idea let me find us another site we will actually never mind one just spawned we will go to it Let's see what we can do here we're probably again gonna have there's a raven but we're not close enough to see what's actually in the site. Give it a second, yeah. So we might sell the battleship by the training implants and buy another alpha injector. What I am going to do is put ours in to see if it has to be applied immediately. There's some weird wording. I don't know if you can just put the points in your head and sit on them, like I'm doing with the 275 we got from the um, tutorial and starting the new character code. But we will actually just see. This heal is not going to... Not gonna have much of a chance here, but kill some stuff to get the credit. But yeah, if we can get both 
and if I can plug them in and just sit on them, I will buy one for, you know, 40 to 50 million. Saves us a bit. Gets us a day's worth of training once we're at our skill cap. I did do some math, or I'm doing some math. I'm going to finish it up and maybe I'll share it in the next. Looking at the different ways of getting skill points and what the most uh, isk efficient is. Not necessarily time efficient, but isk efficient. I conserved a bit of ammo there by killing stuff with uh, one set of guns. It's good because we don't have a lot. We should actually be making isk at some point. I think these rats have at least some. Yeah, I couldn't. Racing this guy is going to be useless. I don't think I could beat him to the punch even if I wanted to. But we only need 30 more points to hit our target. So that is what we're going to do. That is what we're going to do. Our skill plan is moving along pretty nicely, actually. It'd be nice to get those plus three implants. Uh, once we dock up a station, we can see without the implants to get to cruisers. Cruisers, cruisers. Why are they gone again? Nope, oh, there's battle cruiser. Cruisers. There it is. It is, an, is four days. Let's just orbit something here before we die. Pay attention to what we're doing. Jeepers. Don't want to lose another cruiser, uh, destroyer just yet. Then we'd have to sell our uh, <laughs> injector. So it's just under four days to get to cruiser from where we are. And if we put it in the implants, it goes down to three days. So it'd be actually six days for an alpha. Because again, we train half as fast. But it's worth it. So it's about 50 million to get the full set, just a little more. So if we get the battleship, sell it, we can get the implants, we can get a have a little buffer or get ourselves another skill injector. Probably just gonna sit on it and use it for buying our future um, future words. Fittings for our cruiser slash battle cruiser. Yeah, so it's very exciting. Well, let's, let's put on both guns. Too many things going on at once. You gotta watch it. There we go. There. Everything else looks good. Did this guy get? Do we know if this guy? He got loot. I wonder if he's waiting to see if I'm gonna try to loot it. <laughs> nope. Thank you, sir. Is he going to take off? Our tank is holding good, but it looks like because they're shooting him. Yeah, it looks like he's pulling. No, his drones are still out, so he should be staying. If he leaves the drones, we'll pick them up for him. They are Navy Vespas, so they're about three mil, two to three million a pop. So if I've seen people leave them before. What I usually do is grab, scoop them up and take them to a station and contract them back to him. Or see if he wants to meet me in the station. Yeah, you get out of this game which which put in, you know, you treat people nice, and usually you'll get the same in return. Usually, not always. Like any game. You've has its share of hooligans and I don't know, terrible people, but no worse than most games I've played, no most no worse than most multiplayer games I've played, and better than a lot of them. There are games I literally just don't play because I can't stand the people. And Eve is just not that bad. Not as bad as the media wants you to think it is. Anyways, they seem to really relish toting Eve as the uh, place where bad people hang out in video games. And it's just not that. Just not that. I had a comment on one of my videos stating that. And I just, oh. I just don't agree. Yeah, see, these are no problem. There's another 12 points for those. Let's see what we got here. How close are we now? That should be 12 more points. I don't think I saw any more. Come on. Come on, come on. Yeah, one more site should do it. We get either... Uh, this one won't quite do it. This will put us at 79. But killing drones. Either way, we'll get there here in a moment. Nothing else here, so we're going to go to... Sure. Random system. I'll bring you back when we find a site. Did anybody leave anything? No. 
These little guys are too far away, but we can take this guy. We can take him down. 34 of 40, we just need six more kills. And we'll have our battleship, and that'll be wonderful. Take him out, let's start targeting these guys a little bit. They're getting closer. Mostly I think they're fighting the Gnosis, which is fine. Take this guy out and get ready for the spawn. We'll try to race the Gnosis again. I don't think we can beat his drones to it. But we will try. Come on. Go, 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 get me in range. Get the guns on them. Let's see if we can get the killing blow. Nope. Nope, that's all right. That is the name of the game with this alpha guy. It's just impossible to race. There we go. We are done with this event on this character, my friends. Now we can get back to doing our level one missions. Not a bad thing. All right, we are docking up in Dodixie. Dodixie may not be as good as Jita, but it's close to where we're operating, so it saves me a fair bit of time not having to travel, and I'm lazy, so there's that. There we go. And let's redeem our things. Inventory, redeemable items. Take both of these. Yep. Let's go ahead and inject this. Actually, let's watch, we'll do this. And we'll see if it just applies to our queue or if it just adds them here. I'm assuming it's gonna add it here. That's how these things work, right? Confirm. Beautiful, we have 325,000 unallocated skill points, which we are going to use after we train our free five million. Let's go ahead and see which battleship we get. Tempest, so it's not the one we want. We got the skill book too, which is worth something. The Tempest is what it is. If we see market details, we have buy orders. So we're going to get 90 million, so we'll just go ahead and get the injectors. We'll save the rest for fitting, because we could probably spend an easy 20 or 30 million fitting that cruise, that uh, hurricane. It's too bad. What's the, what is the price history like? Do they move? Yeah, so I'm not going to bother with orders. I just, I don't have the, the patience. We're just going to sell it. We're going to lose out 60 million. Yeah, these guys all look pretty active too. I really want those implants. We want the plus threes. I think I can do plus threes. I think I can do them. Neural enhancement there. Yeah, cybernetic three, so. Implant, implant, attribute. That's the basic. Yeah, so nine mil, so nine to 11 million per. Let's just do it. Let's just do it. Get ourselves set up so we can get back into things. 90 million, please and thank you. This way we can buy a little bit of ammo too. And we're gonna go ahead and sell order, make sure it's lowest. One. We'll make sure we can plug them in. Plug in. Uh. Do I have something in that slot already? I must. Yes, I have a. St <laughs> I have a plus one, so we will unplug that one. Goodbye. It is destroyed, and then we can plug this one in now, right? There it is, plug in. Okay, beautiful. 
I probably could just get the ones for the stats we need, but I just like having them all. That way when I switch up my skill plan, I just have all the plus threes. Every little bit helps, right? Memory augmentation basic. That one's 11 million. And then slot three. Neuro boost basic. Ooh, 12 mil. No sense flying six to save one esque or point one esque, so. You'll just buy that one. And then a slot four. Basic cybernetic processor. That's 11 million as well. So we take a bit of a hit, and we have one more slot five. Down here somewhere, limited, social adaption, beta, basic. Got another little cheap one. Double click, and buy. And we'll plug all these babies in. So you can see we have one day, nine hours. That one wasn't the, for any of the skills we have. Plug in. Plug in. One day, eight hours. Plug in. And plug in. So the first one we plugged in probably affected it as well. We just didn't look. But there we go. Shave some training time off. Let's inject this so we have it. There's another book we don't have to buy. So that is nice. But that'll do it for today, guys. Hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, don't forget to give me a thumbs up. And if you're new and you haven't already, don't forget to subscribe as well. Take care of each other. I'm out of here.